Hey guys, it's a Wendy, aka Kitty Street, and I have a quick little Dee Dee's haul for you. I have no idea what day of Vlogmas it's going to be when I put this out, but happy Vlogmas. I hope that your Christmas is fantastic so far. We're getting closer and closer to the most happiest day of the year, at least in my opinion. And yeah, Dee Dee's, I went in there just on a whim. I uh, was killing more time to do another appointment and every single time I go into one of these stores just to, I'm gonna run in this store and kill 20 minutes till I have to go to an appointment or, or waiting for to pick up something or whatever, I hit the freaking jackpot. So stay tuned through this entire video. It, it will not be that long because I don't have a whole lot of items. And go to Dee Dee's. If you have a Dee Dee's in your state, you need to be checking it out pretty much on the reg because every time I walk in there, I guess my eyes eyeball to their pink discount discount clearance tags. And yeah, I was at it again. So first thing I wanna show you, I was opening it up and was gonna put it on my car and do a little short on it. And then I realized, oh, I wanna haul that. So I threw away the little pieces of it, but I went ahead and grabbed it back again. And I'm sorry for the glare, but I picked up me a little reindeer. Um, and it's usually, it's, if it was still attached, it had the two pieces right here. <laughs> Sorry about that. And it shows you, I'm going to move it here. It shows you, it's got the little nose right here and these reindeers with the little bells. And I had, they were hanging right here, but I pulled them apart. And this is a novelty reindeer car decor, ideas in motion. And you kind of get an idea how it's going to look. And it has a little thing on the back here. It was $5.99. Um, these things right here, they, when you roll your window down, which I try not to do too often, will pop out. Just keep that in mind. But yeah, I picked me up a car, car novelty thing, which I thought was just super cute for $5.99. And I will be putting that on my car very soon. Um, I also picked up this bag, but I it, I don't have the price on it. I went to a Kent Sierra and I did vlog that and I put a little bit on there and I didn't do it justice. The, 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 it, a Kent Sierra is like a sweet 16, if you don't know what that is, but it was absolutely beautiful. And I didn't do justice on how wonderful and beautiful it was in my little video, but thank you guys for sharing that time with me. But I did pick up three bags like this from Dee Dee's. They, couple of them were these marble, and I know that glares there, um, by Paper Studio, and it was attached with three of them on there, and one was solid black with gold uh, polka dots on it, and the other two were these marble colors, which I thought was so cute, um, and her theme was Sleeping Beauty, and I just tied that in. I don't know if that worked or not, but they were $2.99, so that's like a buck a bag, and I still had this extra one left, and I'll hold that in my, my storage for when I need to get a gift or something, and I'll have an extra bag already there, but $2.99 for a three-pack I didn't think was bad. Okay, this next item, I had been seeing it in the um, DDs at two different DDs that I go to um, tw about six or seven times. And it was like twice, I don't know how, I'll see it, what the actual price. It was probably about maybe four or five dollars more than what it was. But for some reason, it was marked down um, on the pink ticket. And I wanted a hoodie to wear when I go to um, Six Flags. So I'm going to be trying to do a Six Flags little um, video here in Georgia. I'm going to go do that with the baby Zaire. But they had Homer Simpson <laughs> with this donut uh, reef. Now, everybody can talk about Homer Simpson all he wants to, but he is a, the coolest dude ever, right? So I picked up this um, hoodie. And it was, it doesn't say what it normally was. I think it was like 12 bucks or 12.99 or maybe it was 11.99. They had it marked down to, can you see that? Is it coming up? I can't even tell if it's showing up or not. Oh my goodness. This camera these days. Well, you should be able to see a 6.99 right here, 6.99. And I was like, when I saw the pink ticket, it was my size. Now it's one of those full hoodies that you put over your head with the pockets right here. So when I go to places like a, amusement parks, I don't like to carry any purses in with me. So I have these pockets and I stick everything in the middle of there. And I just absolutely thought that I had to have this. And for six bucks, it was worth it because I'll wear this all winter long. It's going to be a, my snuggly go-to hoodie with Homer Simpson and his donut eating self. I love it. I thought it was cute. And I was so glad that it went on clearance. I was like, oh, I also picked these up. I don't really know why. I, I, I'm kind of second guessing myself. I love leggings and I usually always just get black ones. Um, because I never can um, find any shirts to go with this. But I thought, well, I know I have a thousand black shirts, so I should be able to 
um, fit in these, but these have that fur inside of them, which means, you know, when I go out and about when it's freezing cold and I just want to throw on some leggings, um, I will be able to, it also has this, you know, waist here that kind of pulls you in just a little bit more. And it, this is by Happy Holidays, which I don't know why it has Happy Holidays. I don't think that's really a holiday theme. This, um, I think it's called Hound's Tooth Check, which I happen to love. It's from the 80s. I love that. I wore it when I was younger. And this does say Happy Holidays, K-Y-O. Um, and there's there. And guys, it was two bucks. $2.99 to be exact. So I couldn't resist that. This was the only one I could find for $2.99. They had other designs for $3.99, $4.99, and $5.99. Don't really need a lot of leggings because I don't want to be wearing leggings and growing in them. I try to wear them here and there, but for $2.99, I thought, yeah, I probably could do something with these. Um, maybe I won't regret it. Okay. I got a pair of leggings for $2.99. So I, during this year, and I have several holiday tops um, that I've worn to death. And when I say worn to death, I either got them from the Goodwill or probably from Dee Dee's three or four years ago, or just have had them forever. And I started to realize that the holiday shirts, and what I mean is like something with a little bit more bling bling or something you're going to wear to a Christmas party, were starting to look a bit ratty. I mean, they were really looking bad. I have a lot of clothes, a lot of tops and a lot of things like that, but I need to go through half of them and, and donate them or just get rid of them because they've got little holes around them or, or they're just snaggy or, or they're just worn to death. They're, they're dingy and I just love them and I keep them over and over again. But um, on my birthday, I had a, a, a epiphany that I had really no clothes to wear for a, a nice day out to go to brunch with my daughter. She was taking me to a, a fancy place in Midtown Atlanta. And I was like, oh my gosh. And I didn't really want to go out and buy anything. And it turned out we didn't go. We wound up, we're going to do it another time. Um, and I was glad because the day that we were going to go, I wasn't feeling good on my birthday and kind of just stayed in. And that evening, we went out to a place called Miller's L, Miller's L Steakhouse or something like that and had an awesome time with the family. And it was just as nice. Um, but I was like, you know, I need to probably grab me a couple of little tops. And I wasn't really going in there to look for this. I just saw it. And I did go and try it on because I'm, I'm now thinking now that the try on rooms are there, I don't like to return things. So I said, let me go try this on. So let me show you what, what it looks like and then I'll show you the price of it. Now this one here, it, it's just a black top and it's, it's time, um, you know, I can wear this with anything. And the, if you can kind of see the little starburst in there, I don't know if it's doing justice, but when I put it on, the little beading here is just really nice. Um, it's my size and I'm going to tell you it's made by um, Casa Blue, um, made in China. And it has another little tag right here that shows you what it is. There you go. Very good quality. I thought this was something I could wear with jeans. I could wear it with leggings. I also could wear it, um, you know, with some black slacks or, or maybe even those, maybe even this. I didn't even think about these with it. I don't know. We shall see. But the main thing is that it has a little bit of blingy in it, but not too over the top. Let me see if I can do it like this. And it just, it's just, it's just real pretty. It has some beautiful beading in it. So this right here, I did pay more than I normally would pay for a top because when I tried it on, it was just, I, I loved it. And when I love something, it's that comfortable. I wanted to buy two. They had them in red and they had them in a dark uh, green, but I chose the black because the black would go with everything. And it was $10.99. But for a top for $10.99 that I'll have for year after year, because I'm not going to wear this all the time. This would be something for special occasions, a birthday, holiday parties, something like that. And I can mix and match it with whatever I feel like doing that. But then wasn't going to buy any clothes because I do not need any clothes. I saw this absolutely gorgeous one and I'm a bling person. If you haven't noticed it already, I love a little bling in everything. Everything I have, if you can see my phone case, it's blingy and I, I, I love it. I think if you ever go back and watch my Amazon hauls, I'll show you the bling bling cases that I got. So I saw this one here, another black top, go figure, but it has these little, um, it kind of reminded me like the 80s vibe, the disco ball. <laughs> I don't know. But when I tried it on, it has the the kind of fly butterfly wings. I don't know what you call those arms. Um, and it hangs off your shoulder just a tad. And I thought, oh, I love this. And it's made by 89, 89th and Madison. And it doesn't have any other tags on it. Oh, yeah, it does here. It has a tag. Yeah, 89th and Madison. And it was $7.99. So I got this to have a couple of tops to throw on um, with these, um, with some leggings, with some jeans, or with some um, slacks. 
<laughs> I was just like blown away. Did it really want to spend anything? Wasn't going to buy any more clothes. But because like I said, I really went through all of my nicer things that I've, I love that I have worn year after year after year after year and they were just really, really bad or I couldn't wear them anymore or they just were faded or, or just something was wrong with them and I was getting more and more discouraged. So took some birthday money that I got and got me two tops for less than $20 that I will wear over and over and over again for um, special occasions. And I do have a few other tops that I, you know, I, I still can mix and match, but those I couldn't resist because I loved them. So when I saw, I, when I went to the Kent Sierra, I had these heels on, the red ones. If you go back and watch any of my DD hauls, they're red and they're this very, very high. I loved them. They were very comfortable, but the, the bottoms of them were slicky. And the floor of the Kent Sierra that we were at, when I walked, I felt like, oh goodness, I'm going to fall. I'm going to fall. I'm going to fall. Luckily, I didn't. I loved them. And I thought, okay, the, the, I think I paid $12.99 for those shoes. That was a try to true because when you buy shoes, and I'm not a shoe hawk, a snob, I don't have to pay a hundred dollars for a pair of shoes. If they're comfortable, I don't care if they're a dollar ninety nine or a hundred and dollar hundred and ninety nine dollars. I I need comfort. And when I saw that those were comfort for twelve ninety nine, I said, okay, I'm gonna go back and look. And I was actually looking for some black boots, the half boots, because I didn't bring it. And I said, oh, I was gonna show you. Um, I may show it in my thumbnail. It, I might just take a picture of my ratty old black booty, um, black boots that I call them booty boots. They're real, they're kind of half um, way up your ankle. Horrible. I mean, when I say they are so, <laughs> so worn out, but they are the most comfortable pair of boots I've owned in my life. And I bought them on walmart.com like four or five years ago and they're called Portland. Never have I been able to find those boots. I mean, I have hunted. I spent so much time trying to find those things again that I, I get aggravated. And even ordered some I thought were the ones similar to that and came and they were nothing like them. So these were boots that were, on. they were done. I mean, they were so ratty. And I mean, I'm not throwing them away. I still wear them. I'll still wear them somewhere because they were just awesome. And I'm getting to that. That's why I was in the DDs. I said, well, let me run in here and see if they've got any black boots so I can have something that's not ratty when I'm wearing my clothes out to church or to work or whatever. Um, immediately, I'd, like I said, my eyeballs find these pink tickets like nobody's business. So I'm, I'm going down the shoe aisle and I'm not even in my size, which is like eight and a half or nine. I'm in like six and seven. So if you go to Dee Dee's or any store, look at all the different um, aisles with the different sizes of shoes because they mix and match and people move things around. And these came to mind. Now these are just the little flat wedges and they've got this little bling bling here. And you know, I told you I like the bling bling. And these were size eight, which I usually try to get an eight and a half or, a, or at least an eight wide. Um, and I just wanted to show you. And they got this, you know, the bottom one is kind of pretty much just got that rubbery stuff that's kind of sturdy so you don't, you know, fall. But the main thing is my feet were hurting at that part, at that kids here. And I was like, these would have been perfect to have on, um, you know, just to have a smaller heel. Um, now, one thing that I was like weirded out about it is there is a Velcro piece here that you pull off. <laughs> and you wrap around, but this sucker is hard. And I did try it on with some socks while I was in there and I walked around for like 20 minutes in them um, just to make sure that this wasn't gonna come apart. Cause I was like, don't let me make, waste my money. Just don't do it. Um, these were, I don't know what they normally were. Okay, they were normally $13.99, which I'd have paid that for them. Um, $13.99, $12.99, that's, that's okay. But they were marked down for whatever reason. Can you see that? I hope you can. It's to $9.99. You'll have to trust me if you can't. $9.99. And I was like, what? And so I went ahead and I said, well, I won't wear these all the time. I'll probably wear them to a holiday party or somewhere where I don't want my feet to be hurting. Um, and I can get away with doing some smaller heels. And they have a little bit of bling bling on them. A $9.99 pair of shoes. Dee Dee's, I'm, I'm falling in love with the store. I'm probably going to be doing more Dee Dee's hauls because, like I said, I, I don't go there um, a lot because there's every time I go, well, not every time I go, I find stuff because sometimes I go in there and I'm like, there's nothing here. But when I'm like, got something else to do, just going to run in and run out, I hit every jackpot I can find. Okay, let me show you the other pair of kind of dressier shoes before I actually get into what I found and I was just tickled to death and I've already worn them. Um, but this right here was another pair of shoes that I got and I just loved them. Now they do have the open peekaboo top right there. They, they have the little, I don't know what that pattern is. I don't know what you'd call that, but it's beautiful and it zips up in the back and it does have a bigger heel on it. 
Um, so this would definitely be something I just wear for a couple hours and get out of it because my feet would probably hurt. But I did try them on and I wore them about 10 minutes around the store just to make sure that they were going to. Um, now, they did have a slickier bottom here, so I'll probably get some of that stuff that you put there to kind of keep it from you falling. Um, but I love these and I thought this is something I could wear out somewhere because I, like I said, I, my stuff is so falling apart. It's crazy, especially in the shoe department. Okay, so these right here were normally, it doesn't say what they normally were and I can't pull the tag off. Wait, I think I see, I think they say, maybe it was $15.99, I can't quite see, but they were marked down on that pink ticket and I don't know if you can even see that, maybe if I turn it that way, for $9.99. Even if I just wear these, you know, one or two seasons, um, <laughs> I like them. I like the way they look. I mean, I don't know what's in style because I don't really follow trends like that. But for me, they were comfortable. They give me a little bit of height. I can wear these with my jeans that are too long that I need to have hemmed. So I can wear them with them and they'll make me, you know, have more leg room. And for $9.99, I thought, wow. These were, and I don't know if I told you the name of those other shoes, but these are made by Forever. And these are eight and a half. I don't know if you can even see that. Let me turn it this way. This is Forever brand, eight and a half. And what was this other brand? Because I don't know these brands. And, and like I said, I'm not a shoe snob. Some people would not even purchase a shoe under a hundred bucks. I wouldn't purchase a shoe for a hundred bucks unless it was just something like some Skechers. And I am a Skechers person. People laugh at me all the time, but those are the most comfortable shoes that I've ever found in my life. Oh yeah, these are by Forever too. So maybe there was something going on with the Forever um, company and everything was on sale and I'm so glad they were. So I'm gonna show you the first boots that I found after I found the, the other boots because I bought these other boots at a different um, uh, thing, and she took the tag off of both of these. But I've already worn the main pair of boots that I'm gonna show you. Is that all I have? Oh yeah, I got two more things of jewelry I wanna show you after that. So these here, I was, wa I was walking around, and I had this vision of having these boots with this little fur around it. And I was on Black Friday looking for black boots, and I, I said, well, I'm gonna get some of these, but sometimes you get them and they have this awkward Sometimes they're pointy, sometimes they're oval, sometimes they're flat, and I can't stand them. I'm very picky with that. And I wanted some that I could wear like Christmas socks or something like that with some leggings. And I wanted them to lace up. And they got these kind of cute laces on them. I don't know if you can even see that. They're kind of like almost like leather. And they have really good soles on them. And these here are nine. So that goes to show you the feet size of me. I got an eight and a half. I got an eight and eight and a half. And now I'm at a nine. And these boots here are made by London rag i'm gonna see if i can pull that up there because they're tied together i don't know you can't see that because it's too dark you have to just take my word on it but london london rag yeah you can't see that and these are nines um basically that i just i just tried them on in the store and took them off because when i put them on and they they work and they i like the roundness of them they weren't too weird and they're not you know they're they're not the greatest kind of shoes. I mean, I probably could wear these at least a good winter or two. Um, maybe longer. It just depends because they're that kind of suede kind of material, but I didn't care because they were a 10. <laughs> you see that right there, guys? $10.99. She had taken them out and um, put, a, put this on the side. And this wasn't on clearance. This is just how much the freaking shoes were for $10.99. And I'm like, even if I, I mean, I've bought McDonald's meals in, in a uh, extra burger for somebody for ten dollars so for a pair of shoes that i will wear uh many 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 times and for hopefully many many years for 10.99 dds Dee is definitely the way to go um, i'm hoping that they'll be durable i've i, I don't I've, i have bought a couple of little boots like this before at shoppers world which i've got a haul on that check that out it's um probably already happened um, Shoppers World is another store that's one of those um, very, very deep di discounted stores that you can catch deals on with their coupons. Um, and I bought a pair of, of boots similar to this, but they zipped up and they were more dressy. And, you know, mm, they were comfortable, but after a while, they started getting really ratty. So, and I think I only paid like eight bucks for them and, and they were like on a clearance aisle or whatever. But let me talk about these boots here, okay? So the boots that I'm gonna put in my thumbnail that I wish that I had to show you as I was gonna pull them out and just show you how bad, I mean, the the, the whole part here was just so sunk down because of the years that I've, I've worn them. It was, the suede was all bad. It zipped up from the back and it was frayed. I had to use a, um, a, um, a 
fingernail file because I put them off to the back and zip it up because I couldn't get the zipper to come up. It was just a terrible hot mess. Well, I saw these um, right away and I said, oh, they're not probably going to work because of this, but I actually put them on and they were fine. Now, these are size eight and a half. They're made by Top, that's Top Moda, M-O-D-A. They zip from the side. They are just awesome. I've worn them, I wore them to church on Sunday and they pinch my foot for a while right here in the very front, but they always do that if I don't get wides. Um, I love these boots. I've been to Dee Dee's twice that I know, and I'm probably going to drive across town to one that I don't know because I'm going to find another pair um, because these were so comfortable. And I'm learning when you find something, you better buy a couple of them, and especially something like this because I will wear boots like this. They never go out of style, and I mean that in my opinion. Um, they were because I have actually already worn these, <laughs> but I had to show you what the price of them were. $12.99, guys, for the boots. And I think those ones that I got off of Walmart were like $49.99, and I had like some kind of Black Friday discount for whatever, and I might've got them for like $29.99. These were $12.99, sorry about that glare. And here's the other little thing here, and it's basically just says black boots. It says comparable at $18, uh, yeah, wherever you're gonna find that. Um, ladies boots, you're not gonna find those anywhere anytime for $12.99. So I'm on the hunt out to get another pair of these and talk about me if you want to, but I will find them because I will have these, these will probably last me for another decade and then I'll be looking for them 10 years from now um, when those get ready, right? I don't know. All right, I have two last items. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope everybody is doing well. If you have not subscribed, I don't know why you're waiting. You need to go ahead and do that for me right now. It helps support my channel, and I know you just want to see more of this content. At least I hope so. Um, discounts, discounts, discounts. You're going to find this girl here slaying those streets out there for you. Finding the deals. Every single store I go in there, I don't know. I just have a little bit of a gift, and I just like, what? I'm going to get this, and sometimes I'm like, man, I don't need half the stuff I get, but when I know it's a good deal, one day I'm going to need it, just like those boots, all of these dress shoes. You know, it doesn't hurt to have a few pieces in your closet when you want to go out. At least I'm justifying that way. I also, this right here has been one of the necklaces that I have looked online and I have had it in my Amazon cart. I've had it in, I bought it, I saw it at Kohl's. I've seen that at Target. I've seen it at um, Macy's. Um, I've seen this same little drop um, <laughs> Um, necklace, which I, I had a, a outfit on at the Kent Sierra that I wore that I bought. I got at Dee Dee's. It was a black uh, breast, a, like a double breast suit jacket with the satin collar on it. I bought that for eleven ninety nine. dollars I didn't show it to you because it's wadded up somewhere in my floor from when I got home from the party. And I bought um, some leggings and another top to go under it that was like $5.99 a piece. And I wanted to wear this one with it, but I decided that, you know, I don't know where I was going. I don't know how much bling bling I can get away with. But when I saw this, um, it's and especially because it's from the Forever 21 brand, which is, you know, pretty popular. Um, I said I got to have it. So it's one of those necklaces you put on and it drops down. I thought it would be great with a low neck, um, you know, top. Um, it was $7.99. Now, I don't normally ever pay that kind of um, money for any kind that's costume jewelry. But... Again, I have been holding this in a cart for like two or three years. And I always said, if I ever see one that's got the V and the drop, when I saw it, I'm like, Dee I'm in love with you. I, I, I'm just so in love with you. So it's $7.99, Forever 21. I haven't worn it completely yet, but I thought, it, you know, it's costume jewelry, but I will have this piece for a while and I'm hoping that it will look good um, sometime when I go out in the near future. Last but not least, guys, I did purchase this ring. Now, I love cosmetic jewelry. This is another ring that I got from um, Dee Dee's too. It's got a, like an opal in it, or I think it's a lot white opal. And these are just, you know, the beautiful details on there. I don't even know if you can see that at all, but these rings are just to die for, you know, and I can't, I'm not gonna go out and, and purchase all of that, you know, money for different types of rings because I like a variety. And so I got this one. I don't remember how much it was. It was either between $5.99 or $6.99. And when I saw this one, which I'm going to put on right now, and I'm probably going to wear it on my next video, it was um, 
$6.99, which they've gone up. They, they used to be $4.99 and $5.99, but since the inflation, you know, the, why not make the jewelry go up as well? So it was $6.99. And this was actually something that somebody was with me, bought for me. And he said, I'm going to buy this for you because you, you want it. And I'm like, yeah, I do. I really do. So I bought this ring or if it was bought for me, um, paid for somebody else. But you can't even see the gesso. But when you hold it in the light, the little whatever those things in there kind of just, you know, just kind of flare. I thought it was very beautiful. So this is a size eight. Um, I usually go for about an eight and a half or a nine. It just depends on, you know, if I'm swollen that day from eating too much or whatever. <laughs> is the truth of the truth. Um, but this one here, I think is a nine and it's a little bit looser. But anyway, guys, with that said, check, I hope you have a DDs, check it out. Um, it's awesome. The prices are awesome. I'm probably going to go there one more time before Christmas and just see what I find. And if I do, I will maybe even do a come with me and maybe even a try on shopping. I mean, try on, um, haul of clothes that I may or may not buy. All right, guys, with that said, please consider um, subscribing, ringing the notification bell, sharing my video, and liking, comment. Give me comments. I love your comments, guys, and beautiful people out there. I appreciate you. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and all of that. And until the next one, take care, guys. Bye.